Oh, even a rabid mongoose wouldn't have a chance now. Oh, nice time. Hey guys, welcome back to Take 5. I'm Jake. I'm Meg. And today we're checking out the classic film Dodgeball. Because we're better than you. And you know it. Yeah! Oh, hello. I'm White Goodman. Here at Globo Gym, we understand that ugliness and fatness are genetic disorders, much like baldness or necrophilia. And it's only your fault if you don't hate yourself enough to do something about it. Because here at Globo Gym, we're better than you. And we know it. One of the best films of all time, for me anyways, is Dodgeball. Released in 2004, uh, Dodgeball is about two guys who sort of have a rivalry. Walk with me. You've got um, Vince Vaughn, who plays Peter LaFleur. And he owns this Average Joe's gym. He doesn't have an ambition, does he? Next door to, to Average, Average Joe's, Joe's, you've got Globo Gym. <laughs> Run by White Goodman. Who's this peppy little Ben Stiller character who's like... Ben Stiller character. Ben Stiller, <laughs> Stiller character. Ben Stiller. <laughs> ben Stiller character played by Ben Stiller. My gym's worth over four million dollars. Your gym isn't worth four. I have shareholders. You haven't even got... Cup holders. And yeah. he's a bit of a douche. Best bring your bib, because it's going to get messy. Ah! Oh! So basically what happens is Global Gym wants to take over um, Average Joe's, you know, destroy it, have their parking lot. He's in trouble with his taxes, so he owes yeah. £50,000 or dollars yeah. to the government. And that's actually where we meet Kate, who's played by Christine Taylor. Thank you. I'm not a banker. I'm a lawyer. Really? And what kind of law are you involved in, Pretty Eyes? Sexual harassment, mostly. Hey! Fact! Ding! Was Ben Stiller's wife for a while. Really? She yeah. was co-Ben Stiller! A real sauciness that I find extremely attractive. So they owe the tax man $50,000 and they try to come up with some schemes of making that money when they see in a magazine. In a magazine? There's an advert for the Dodgeball Championships and the prize is, strangely, $50,000. $50,000. Who'd have thought? White Goodman is watching them from a secret cardboard cutout. It's crazy, this film. It's great. It's so good, though. It's so <laughs> and he doesn't want them winning $50,000 because he wants to knock down their gym to turn it into a car park. So he enters his own team. Meet Fran Stalinaskovich Davidovitsky. <laughs> and they end up going head to head to win the prize. We are the Globo Gym Purple Cobras. And we will, we will rock you. To be part of it, they have to actually win the first comp the, the first sort of game. Yeah. And they're against these girl guides. Who like just kicked the bazookas out of them. They are a terrible dodgeball team. They've never played it before <laughs> in their lives. <laughs> One of the Girl Scouts is on beaver tranquilizers yeah. to enhance. You got hairy arms. Yeah. By rule, your team must be disqualified. Damn you, Bernice! Oh. <laughs> so by disqualification, <laughs> they get through to the, the national competition. They do, yeah. My name's Patches O'Houlihan. I'm your new coach. The very famous dodgeball guy, Patches O'Houlihan. Played by Rip Torn, an incredible actor and very funny. He watches them in this tournament being beaten by Girl Scouts and he wants to train them. <laughs> If you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. What? Oh. Oh. <laughs> I don't know how they don't die. They're getting metal wrenches in their face. He's They're like, ah. like, surely that would kill you. <laughs> ben Stiller's character in this is brilliant. It's phenomenal. It's so funny. Actually, the balance between the two work really, yeah, really well. Yeah, there's a really good rivalry between them, and it's just play, they play so well on the screen together. You've got the scent of a lesser stag in your nostrils. Be oh, oh! You don't get to touch me ever. Okay, Romeo. Let me help you up. Get off of me! Don't you touch me! Nobody makes me bleed my own blood. Nobody! Memorable moments in the film, I'd say, when their costumes get mixed up <laughs> and they end up 
in the first round of the dodgeball tournament wearing leather S&M outfits. This isn't what I ordered. Average Joe's Gymnasium. One of the characters has got a, a wife who we brought online and she hates him and he, she keeps going like that and he thinks it means love. <laughs> hey honey! L for love! Good times. There's loads of cameos in this film as well. You've got William Shatner pops mm -hmm. up playing the judge of the tournament. Yeah, you have Hasselhoff. David, David Hasselhoff. Hasselhoff. Losers! <laughs> Thank you Chuck Norris. You know, Chuck Norris doesn't do push-ups, he pushes the world down. <laughs> I love this film. I mean, I could watch it over and over again. It's easy to watch. It's funny. You you don't really get bored of Ben Spiller. Yeah. I, I would probably give this about an 8.5. Yeah, five for me, I'd give it a 9. 9. All right, I'll I bump up. I love this film. It's so funny. I'll bump up. I could watch it again and again. Yeah, I'll bump up. You'll bump up to 9? Or yeah. should we go 8.75.5? No, let's bump to nine. Yeah? Nine. nine. I won that tournament. <laughs> Chuck Norris. So have you seen Dodgeball? What do you think of it? Let's know in the comments below. And remember guys, every Wednesday, 12 o'clock, we release a brand new video. So make sure you subscribe and hit that bell. That's all from us. Catch you next time. Bye.